Right, Sergeant. Five minutes. Five minutes. You know, I don't think this is any kind of metal. Then what, sir? Captain Potter, can you tell me yet how long this is going to take? I realize it must be difficult. Look, sir, yeah. I advise you to leave. Yes, I know. Uh, you'll appreciate I have a special interest. How long would you say? I don't know. Yet. You're a young man. You can't possibly have had the wartime experience that would... I should call in a second opinion. Is that it? Well, yes. But don't worry. I intend to. GM2. Yeah, just a moment, sir. It's uh, Colonel Breen. Oh, well, I'll take it. Scrambler? No, it's blue. It's clear. Hello? I'm afraid Colonel Breen's not available. What's it about? A bomb? But surely you realize he's no longer connected with... How big? Good God. Give me the details. I'll get the message to him as soon as he's free. What is there to argue about? The purpose is quite clear. Colonel Breen, my rocket group has been intended all along for peaceful scientific research. Professor Quatermass, your rocket group? Yes, mine. I brought the whole thing into being. But it is, after all, a government project. And now the government has had a change of policy. Change of policy. You're going to take it over and pervert it to this... this... Listen. Within ten years, there will be permanent bases on the moon, perhaps even on Mars. Military bases? Of course. The present world situation makes that quite clear. Whoever plants them first will be able to police the Earth with ballistic missiles. So we must be in the race. Well, of course. The ultimate weapon. It always is. Gentlemen, don't you see? We are on the edge of a new dimension of discovery. It's a great chance to leave our vices behind. War, first of all. Not to go out there dragging our hatreds and our frontiers along with us. Frankly, I'm surprised and disturbed to hear such naive views still being put in. Naive? You lost touch with humanity. You've been shut away too long in this ivory fortress of yours. That's your trouble. Well, he'll be out of it soon. Colonel Breen is joining you at the rocket group. What? At the end of the week. I think you'll agree that someone with experience of military rockets, missiles, will be of considerable value. I'll fight this right at top level. I shouldn't. It came from there. It'll work out for the good of the group. And now, gentlemen, if you'll both excuse me, I have another meeting. Nose to the grindstone.